Welcome back to SSN24. Today, we dive into the recent developments surrounding the Denver Broncos and Russell Wilson's contract dispute that has sent shockwaves through the NFL. In a surprising turn of events, Mark Mask of the Washington Post revealed that the Broncos had previously threatened to bench Russell Wilson for the rest of the season if he didn't agree to rework his contract, specifically addressing the injury guarantee. This revelation came after the Broncos' upset victory over the Chiefs on October 29. The situation reached a point where the NFL and the NFL Players Association became involved, hinting that Wilson sought intervention. However, the league and union couldn't force the Broncos to play him, given the team's right to protect against a substantial injury guarantee. Despite the threat, the Broncos didn't act on benching Wilson until this week, raising eyebrows considering their playoff contention. As the team started winning, they seemed willing to take the risk with Wilson, possibly reassessing the situation as the season progressed. The report sheds light on the ongoing struggle between the Broncos and Wilson over his guaranteed money, signaling the inevitable end of their partnership. Wilson is expected to be cut, becoming a free agent with the freedom to choose his next destination. As the drama unfolds, speculations arise about Wilson's future. If he's open to playing in 2024 for the veteran minimum, set at $1.21 million, he's likely to attract numerous suitors. The Broncos may end up paying the rest, making him an attractive option for teams looking to bolster their roster. In conclusion, the Broncos and Russell Wilson find themselves at a crossroads. The once-promising partnership is on the verge of dissolution, paving the way for Wilson to explore new opportunities in the NFL. Stay tuned for further updates on this gripping saga. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more in-depth sports analysis. Thanks for joining us on SSN24, and we'll catch you in the next one.